Hey, it's Matt and today I've got Sam with me and today we are going to be going on the Grandfather Trail which is probably the best hike in North Carolina and there's meant to be loads of inclines, ladders and climbs which uh, all sounds really exciting but I can feel my legs burning already. Let's do this! Woo! <laughs> So far we have gone maybe six, seven hundred meters from the parking lot. Not too bad, but I sense that that was just a warm up. But it's a nice little warm up after driving, what, nearly two hours uh, from Greensboro, where I live. Actually, that last part of the drive along the Blue Ridge Mountain Parkway, uh, Blue Ridge Parkway, uh, was really nice. But it's good to get out and stretch the legs and I'm expecting a lot more elevation on this grandfather trail. It's a loop. Yeah, it's a there and back trail. So we are starting kind of here, which is not even this peak yet. And from this peak, 5844 to 5946 is a climb. Ready? Apparently skipping is the way to do this trail, according to Sam. And I need to get up there. <laughs> It looks just like Hong Kong. So Sam and I both used to live in Hong Kong and with the buildings, uh, high-rise buildings, what? at least for North Carolina and that rock jutting out is very typical of a lot of Hong Kong hikes, which we miss. But hey, <laughs> here we are, North Carolina, onwards. So pleasant on a beautiful, beautiful day. Sun is out, not too hot. Of course, we're up in the mountain, so it's a nice, cool breeze. So perfect activity for today, I think. Do you like it so far? I love it. Love I it. Love the trees. I love the rocks. <laughs> I have everything I need. Sam lives in New York, by the way, so he's like, ooh, m moss. <laughs> when you realize it's a video. This is definitely a hiking trail for somebody who doesn't mind heights or wants to conquer their fear of heights. But the view is absolutely amazing. Oh, for a second there we thought we we're gonna have to like somehow get around the side of that cliff but actually the trail's just that way. lunch stop here at Macray Peak which is actually only I think about just over a third till we end up at Callaway Peak where we're aiming to go. The view is of course absolutely stunning from here uh, but over there in the distance we can actually also see the Blue Ridge Parkway which is that scenic drive that we took to come here to this morning.
fun. <laughs> so much variety in this trail, which is amazing. <laughs> I was thinking like we'd done most of the climbing, but uh, I thought that way too soon because, okay, here we go, up. I think I need more exercise normally in my life. <laughs> that power is a bit of a killer though. No ladders, but incline and you definitely want to keep your hands free so you can climb up those rocks, but still loads of fun. Oh, now we're trying to debate whether that particular peak is actually Callaway Peak where we're going to end up or uh, it's the next peak along. I really hope it's that one because the next one along looks a little bit too far for today. What did you just say, Sam? <laughs> so inappropriate. <laughs> How do you know what an Indian house cave looks like? How many Indian house caves have you seen? Not enough, apparently. Exactly. I've seen one and this is it, so. I mean, I'd be happy if this were my house if I were a caveman. It's big. It's like three Hong Kong flats put together. The incline's not very much, but as kind of expected, it's not as if we just keep going steady up. We're going down and up and down and up. Well, we're at it. This view, like I said, does quite remind me of Hong Kong and some parts of this hike as well. Uh, actually, this particular view reminds me a lot of my favorite hike in Hong Kong, Ma An San Trail, uh, which I have another video of. So uh, why don't you check it out and let me know in the comments whether or not you agree that some of it is quite similar to the uh, view and the kind of terrain. How are you doing? All right. Good. So that way. We made it, we're here at Callaway Peak. We made it in just under three hours. But if you're not filming a YouTube video and stopping all the time like me, um, then you'd probably be able to do it at the speed we were doing it in like about 30 to 45 minutes less, I think. Uh, the view here is very beautiful. Uh, I would say maybe compared, compared to Macray, Macray was a bit more open uh, here. The view is a little bit more wild. Everything's really green, trees covering the mountainside. Um, so, hey. What do you think? Macray or Callaway Peak? Which view do you prefer? So we were just about to bomb it down and then we saw the sign saying Watauga Peak, Watauga? Uh, however you pronounce it, uh, 100 feet 
this way and I'm so glad we did because the view here is I think so much better than Callaway Peak which it was nice uh, you, you get all the you know greenery and the trees and the, the contours but this view is much more open uh, kind of a bit more like McRae Peak but uh, same same but different so definitely don't miss Watauga Peak if you are coming here badger 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 mushroom mushroom look it's a Sam sized Indian house is this what you think of as a, actually looks like an Indian house? I've seen many Indian houses in my lifetime and this is definitely an Indian house. Prime real estate right here. Oh, my name. <laughs> We did it! Woo! <laughs> oh, we're back at our vehicle. Actually took longer than I expected for us to come back down, but uh, yeah, going down is actually quite a lot harder in a lot of cases than going back up. So definitely feeling it in our legs. So we're gonna go back to this car park, which now looks very empty and try and check out this swing bridge that everyone seems to go to when they come here to Grandfather Mountain State Park. Many visitors consider the walk across the swinging bridge the highlight of their trip to Grandfather Mountain. Hi everybody, welcome to Matt's live channel on YouTube. We're here in North Carolina walking Grandfather's mountain and we're currently at the swinging bridge. Now no longer called the swinging bridge, it's more so the singing bridge given that the winds cause us a whistling noise. Yep, definitely whistling. I would say that was an absolutely amazing hike. I really enjoyed it. Absolutely, it's yeah. a wonderful day. Yeah. Lots uh, of rocks, lots of trees. Lots of rocks, lots of trees. From all the hikes I've been so far in North Carolina, I think this absolutely is my favorite, so I think it is well deserved to uh, get the title of North Carolina's best hike here at the uh, Grandfather Trail. We've just come here to the Swinging Bridge, Singing Bridge, Mile High Bridge. Um, views are okay, so I, I guess if you're not hiking, this would be a cool place to come. It's, it's cool to visit anyway. So actually, this is our first day of our four-day road trip across North Carolina and then we're going to go to the Smoky Mountains and therefore into Tennessee. Uh, tonight we're headed to Asheville so and we'll carry on driving along the Blue Ridge Parkway tomorrow. Should be nice. really scenic so check out more of these videos when they are available. If you fancy it subscribe to my channel for more adventures in unusual places like North Carolina and I will see you all in the next video with Sam. That's a wrap! That's a wrap! Woo! And here we have the lovely Grandfather Mountain, North Carolina. Mile high swing bridge. Elevation 5278. And I guess that is how you join the Mile High Club here in North Carolina.